You guys, I am way too excited for this. I'm gonna start this video off by saying that there are timestamps down below in the description, so if you came for just the reaction and you don't care about what I'm gonna say for the next couple minutes, you can skip right ahead to it. But I do wanna put a disclaimer out there for those of you who are new to the channel and for those of you who are not. To the new people watching, first of all, Hello. You 100% don't know who I am, but basically what I do on this channel is pretty much all gaming content. I've only done one reaction video in the past, and I've put a couple of music related things of like my own original music and a cover up on this channel. But if you're coming to this channel expecting it to be like straight up reactions, that's not what it is. So this is kind of just like a one off thing that maybe every once in a while I'll upload reactions to stuff that I want to. So those of you who are not new to the channel, I'm sorry if this is not what you were expecting, but you don't have to worry. I got a video coming up 5 p.m. Eastern of a gameplay. But I have to react to this because this is my favorite band. Usually on my way home from work, I'll pop open the YouTube app and find something to listen to. Today, I just happen to want to listen to Animals as Leaders. And in searching for the band on YouTube, I found out that they released a new single a couple of days ago that flew completely under my radar. It boggles my mind because I've consistently been looking for like new stuff from these guys for literally years. The last time they put out an album, was in 2016. But it's not a big deal because I'm gonna be listening to this now. For those of you who don't know who Animals as Leaders is, they're an instrumental progressive metal band with like jazz and classical influences kind of thrown in there. There's a little bit of also like electronic music style in a way, I guess, and they're incredibly experimental. Their last album, The Madness of Many, was kind of their push forward into a new sound of theirs that was kind of a mixture of all three band members. As I said, this is my all time favorite band. I used to listen to these guys as a senior in high school, walking home from school on my iPod touch, just blasting the original album, sometimes in the pouring sideways rain, just not caring at all, thoroughly enjoying the music. So this band has an incredibly special place in my heart and I'm very, very excited to get into this. So let's do it. Gotta turn my headphones up. Ooh. Okay. Okay, already switching up the rhythms, huh, Mela? <laughs> oh, I don't know what to expect now, jeez. Very good choreography. Whoa. Okay, switching to four now. <laughs> This is basically what I was like when I first listened to Animals as Leaders. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I love that.
Wow. That. That was really that was really cool. That was incredibly cool. My God, I have a lot to say about this. There's a lot going on in this that's kind of lying under the surface, and that tends to happen a lot with this band. I will say it's incredibly rhythmic heavy compared to a lot of their other stuff, but that seems a bit on track with their last album, The Madness of Many. That album had a handful of tracks on it that were just straight up like almost rhythm through guitar, if that makes any sense. And obviously the drums are a big driving force in this one. Um, I feel like I feel like every instrument in this sounds like a drum. And that's one thing that I really find interesting about this band is that they can get so many different sounds out of their instruments that it almost doesn't make sense. A lot of that is achieved through a technique on the guitar called thumping. I'll leave like a little example of the lead guitarist kind of explaining how it works. I would call it thumping just because I feel like conventional slapping. Um, it's just basically a percussive one hit, you know? But I'm getting a bit more note and I'm getting two strokes per per stroke. Two note, yeah. So I'll, I'll go into how I'm doing that. Basically, um, like I said, you can produce a downstroke and an upstroke, right? So I'm using half nail and half like flesh of my thumb. Yeah, so two strokes, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, like that. Sometimes you can hammer on the first note and then thump two to get a group of three. Like that. Or you can do a group of three by adding your index finger. So you have one, two, three, one, two, three, like that. That seems to happen a lot in this song. There seems to be a lot of thumping going on. And the number one thing that stood out to me is just the rhythmic changes. It's like almost hard to wrap your head around. This is definitely one of those songs that you kind of have to listen to more than once to kind of figure out what the rhythm is all about. I was able to keep up like in the first segment, but as it kind of pushed towards the end, there's like so much going on that it's really hard to grasp what time signature you're in. And I've always had an affinity for music that does that. I've always loved progressive metal because it's music that just basically doesn't stay the same the whole way through. And while this song has like kind of the same sound, the same theme throughout, I think the rhythm changing as much as it did kind of matches that progressive metal style. And as for the video itself, it's very interesting to me that they didn't have any shots of the band actually playing normally in some of the other videos, except for maybe one or two that I've seen by this band. It's, there's always like at least one or two shots of the band playing the music. In this one, it seems like they really wanted to push for this choreography based music video. And I think it was done very well. It absolutely matches the band's theme, like their overall theme, at least for the last album. Like this kind of gives me vibes. I've said this already, but it gives me vibes of the last album they put out. And I think the environment they're in is really cool. The design choice for the clothing and makeup and all that stuff, it worked really well. And the choreography, like as wild and wacky as it is, it really matches kind of the feel of the song. I don't know if this is just like an exclusive single or if this is gonna be like kind of the push for the new album. I'm, I know they are working on a new album and I really hope that it comes out soon because I've been waiting for like four or five years for the new album to come out. But I am not at all disappointed. This was really cool. This is definitely like on par with what I expect from the band. They've put stuff out in the past like to kind of tease the next album and the album itself ends up exceeding my expectations. The one thing that I really like about this band is how experimental they are and how much they like to try new things with their sounds. This doesn't really do that necessarily, but when I hear a single by the band, I know for a fact that it's not gonna be a reflection on the album as a whole. Every single album that this band has put out is, you know, it starts off as one thing and throughout the course of the album, it becomes many other things. So that's 100% what I'm expecting for hopefully the new album that's hopefully coming out. But overall, I am not disappointed at all. This was an incredibly cool video, an incredibly cool song and I'm super excited. Again, I apologize for anyone who doesn't really like reaction videos, but this, like I said, this is my all time favorite band. And when I saw this on my way home from work, I played like the first, like maybe 15 seconds of it. And I knew I just had to react to this. There's definitely a lot of bases that I'm not able to cover because my mind is just 
still trying to process what I just listened to. Definitely gonna give this another few listens after I turn the camera off. So I apologize if there's things that I maybe should have said that I didn't. There's just a lot about this band that I know and love and a lot about the music that they create that I know and love. But I, I just, I wanna listen to it again. <laughs> so yeah, as I said before, for anyone who's expecting a gaming video, I'm sorry this wasn't it, but it will be coming at 5 p.m. No need to worry. But otherwise, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button down below. Don't be afraid to leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. Tell me what you think of the song. If you liked it, if you didn't, what criticisms you have. I know it's not for everyone, so I'm open to all criticisms on this video and the song alike. I'd like to have a discussion with people about it. And yeah, that's going to be it for me. I'm wrapping it up here. Thanks everyone for watching. And I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.